Welcome to today's demo of Hyperscience and AWS. In this video, we will see how Hyperscience's Intelligent Document Processing Platform and Amazon Web Services can be leveraged to modernize insurance operations. To get started, let's take a look at a sample architecture diagram. In this design, documents are being ingested via Amazon S3. Then, a Lambda function is being triggered to create a Hyperscience submission. Once Hyperscience completes classification and extraction, the platform sends an event notification to SQS via a native connector. This event then triggers another Lambda function to parse the extracted data and place the final output in another S3 bucket. With the extracted data in S3, Athena and QuickSight can then be leveraged to further analyze aggregated output. Now let's see this workflow in action with the sample document. Here we have an Accord 25 form. Let's drop this file in the appropriate S3 bucket. This will trigger our Lambda function to create a submission in Hyperscience using the Hyperscience REST API. Switching to Hyperscience, we can now see the new submission. Hyperscience will first classify the document, then extract the relevant fields. As you can see here, there were a total of 108 fields and Hyperscience was able to transcribe 100% of them automatically without human intervention. Now let's take a look at the extraction results. Selecting a field, we can see Hyperscience provides both normalized output and raw output. The normalized output allows consistent output to be sent to external systems and is helpful when data can be written in multiple formats, such as dates and phone numbers. Let's take a look at this field containing an address. As you can see here, the data type of this field is set to address, which gives the machine context into what it can expect. Hyperscience was able to transcribe this field accurately and differentiate between these characters because of our machine learning models. Hyperscience measures accuracy at the field level, not at the character level, and as such, Hyperscience will not attempt any characters unless it can extract the whole field correctly. When Hyperscience is not able to automatically transcribe the data in a field in order to meet the customer's accuracy SLA, we leverage humans to augment the solution within our Human in the Loop UI, where the business user can key in the value to assist the solution only when needed. Now that this submission is complete, we can expect Amazon SQS to be notified, which ultimately triggers a Lambda function to parse and save the output. After navigating to the S3 bucket where the submission output is stored, here we see the submission's final output. Now, in a world where we have hundreds of thousands or millions of submissions, we can leverage Amazon Athena and QuickSight to query and visualize this data. Here we are in Athena where we performed a simple query to retrieve entries. We could then leverage Amazon QuickSight to visualize the data that has been queried. That brings us to the end of our demo. Visit the Hyperscience listing on the AWS Marketplace and review the Hyperscience and AWS co-authored blog to learn more.